the ocean swallowed Atlantis. And before recorded history, there was an age when mythical kingdoms spread across an uncharted world. This was the age of Conan. Enslaved as a boy, Conan grew into a warrior. He escaped to encounter mystery, magic, and myth, while forever facing the ultimate master of sorcery. Brother, friend, hero. dark places, or water over a foot deep. We were headed east trying to locate Hisazul's stronghold, and already we're running into two out of the three. of Asgard. Legends? What legends? The legends of the beast men who live in the mountain and an old witch who lures men into her grasp. It's old wives' tales, huh? In case the old wives were right. Somebody give me a hand. At least somebody has a heart. And he's dry. Here I come. Up the mountain! 
a nice cheerful fire they say the pass that leads to the valley beyond is somewhere up here if we can find it i will you're not gonna leave us here are you you can come with me or wait until i come back have a safe trip thank you my friend those soldiers have no sense of humor but they're smart enough to fear the beast man I thought you had the magic to start fires anywhere, Otley. I do, but this wind has the magic to put them out. Zebin insists that Conan has been captured by the Beastmen. He wants us to go look for him. Oh, that's right. Let's everyone go off in a wild goose chase and leave me here, by myself! Exactly. You stay here while we're gone, in case he comes back. I've half a mind to wake this manling up and make him work for himself. This manling has size and strength. Perhaps the outside world is a better place than we are told. We will never know. As Azul has deemed us to mine or for. It is our fate.
This madly killed him. And he just left his body on the mountainside? Could bring them both. This creature weighs a ton. No manling has ever killed a Bruthian huntsman. Take him before Gakri. He can work to make up for it. We don't it. take orders from you, old Rob. It would be my master's wish. Not my own. We will take him to the throne room, Gorba. He's much closer than the pet. <laughs> Sword of Atlantis. It's colder than ice. Something must have happened to Conan. He would have never left his sword behind. So are we. God, let's tell Otley the news. Ah, this is a large one. And he's vicious, Godfrey. He murdered Craw. How? With a sword, Master. Great sword, like the weapons of old. What do they call you, Madling? I'm a man, not a manling. I'm not sure you'll make a very good slave. I'll make no slave at all, you animal. <laughs> you call me an animal. You're the workhorse here, Madling. So you see, I treat well-behaved humans nicely. She also treats me well. What kind of woman are you? Those a beast like this. You're a prisoner in Bruthium. You'll ask no questions. Down on your knees, Manling. Down, Manling. <laughs> Take him to the pen. You will learn, large one. You will learn. <laughs> Welcome to the slave pens of Brutheim. My name is Kiord. I am foreman of this sector. Conan of Sumeria. Your hands are still bound. Gorba and Gaul clearly fear you. <laughs> they would fear me more if they knew how close they came to death. <laughs> yes, yes. I heard how well you battled before they captured you up above. Not well enough. <laughs> Let me help you. <laughs> we have a little food left over from feeding time. Do not let hunger weaken you. Feeding time? I'm not a beast of burden. We all are. You'll get used to it. All newcomers resist at first, but beatings, starvation, this is all you can look forward to if you don't. Like Kior and Dara. Have lived their whole lives in darkness. Those of us who still remember life above ground. Try hard to forget. You can fight to be free. How? Any way you can. With this. 
is the only life we've ever known, Conan. Those who come from above, like you, bring us our only other view of the manlings. We are men. No. No. We are manlings. In time, you will be one as well. There is no escape from the slave pens of Brutheim. Only death. I will escape. Why do you disturb me when I'm instructing my new serving girl? Now I'm sure. My wizard. What I thought this morning. What could be more important than serving girl? Yes, instructing can be wearing on you. But I thought you should know about Conan. But you are still alive. Conan, Conan, what about him? As far as I know, he spends most of his time interrupting my most intimate moments. He is in the land of the Berithians. I do not give a pig's ear for the Berithians, as long as they find all they are beasts. Forgive me, your great one. I only repeat what has been spoken by these creatures, their words, having little meaning beyond their own land. And why tell me? Conan was chased there by your soldiers. He is now a prisoner. It would be an opportunity to destroy him. He has the strength of ten men, but the beast men will wear him down or throw him in the pit and watch him die. I would like to see that too. We must allow that entertainment for the bear people. Mm, you are most generous, O oh Great One. But that will take time. So, meanwhile, we will watch Conan mine some ore. And if he escapes, no one has ever escaped from the mines. That is history. We are dealing with the present. You are being very insolent. And if you are not careful, I will put wine in your water and give you the morning pain. I should have gone with him. He would not have stood a chance against whatever took Conan. Thinks we should go down the mountain and face his Azul's monkeys. Great ideas, Evan. Why don't we just throw ourselves on top of them? We just need to find Conan or the pass he was seeking. What difference does it make what we do? We're just gonna freeze to death anyway. Not if you keep the fire going. Oh, no problem. Once I run out of firewood, I'll just, uh, I'll just burn our clothes. Who's gonna be the first to donate his pants? Yours look like they might last a couple of days. He thinks we should wait out the night, and if Conan's not back by the morning, we should go back down the mountain, face our fate, and die like men. This is depressing. I'm gonna go look for some more wood. For one, agree with Zebin. If Conan's not back by dawn, we go back down the mountain and take those snakes to hell. If we're still alive. Don't kill me. I've already risked my life to come here. I know you hate me for helping the beastmen trap you. I couldn't help it. I saw no ropes holding you on a mountainside. If I tried to run, Gakri would cut my throat. And then kill ten slaves in reprisal. 
Do you think I like living this way? Seeing the world just outside my reach? What do you want? To hear about the cities where humans rule. If I tell you, will you help me to escape? I can't. You think I've sold my soul to these beastmen, and I'm no better than they are. What choice did I have? Either live as Gokri's lapdog, or to grovel in the dirt and not help any of the other prisoners. I wish Brutime would fall to ruins and be ground under the heel of his Sazul. Wake up! Don't let them see you, Gokri. Wake up, dogs! It's time to go to work! Move! Wake up! Wake up! Move! Or I'll whip your naked skin raw! Move! This one's violent. But we'll work it out of him. Who's that? One of the children. Sit. I'll be the judge of that, Kiorn! Leave her alone. This is 
food for pets. Eat it. Otherwise, they don't feed you for days. What is the thing they call gabla? Pray you never find out. The work has made you strong, Kirov. You should use your strength for freedom. You've been summoned to the throne room, Manling. Make one cult's move. And at your head will take the Valkyrie. for you, not Gakri. Are you not afraid your master will find us? He's sleeping, soundly. I drugged his wine. I wanted to thank you for saving me today, Manly. My name is Conan. You've been whipped. All slaves are whipped, except you. Come closer. I felt my share of the lash. Now come. Sit beside me. Tell me about the human world. I've heard there are cities even greater than Brutheim, built not by beasts, but by men like you and me. Is this true? Yes. What are the people like who live in these cities? Some are strong, others are weak. They're good and bad. Courageous and cowardly. Are the women beautiful? Some of them. Is there really such a thing as ships that sail huge oceans manned by humans? And do men really ride upon long-legged animals that move like the wind? <laughs> yes. We call them horses. <gasps> but now you tell me something. What is the connection between Wultheim and this wizard Hisazul? The ore from our mines. I've never seen a manly... a man. So strong and noble as you are. His Azul must have great interest in this ore. I have never heard of it. It was discovered this. a generation ago. It forges into a metal that's stronger than iron. And the Bruthians make them into great weapons for the wizard's war effort. Let me see these weapons. There are some magical ones in the next chamber and many more below. There. With weapons like these, this Azul will conquer the and all of Brutheim will move above ground at last. He lies. Next time you try to drug me, make sure I drink the wine. Kill him! <laughs> Survive the tunnels of Rutam again. <laughs> Strip her of her finery and throw her in the pins with the rest of the slaves. <laughs> Goodbye, man. I'll see you in hell.
to a hero. I'm not a coward either. Become an apprentice! Learn a trade, my mother says. Leave adventures to fools! But did I listen? No! Ah! Escaped. Without that smoke. <laughs> <laughs> this knife on yourself? The thought has crossed my mind more than once. But you did not. You must fight. Men take their freedom, not their lives. If you want fight, then flee.
to the surface! Not yet. Wait! You're going the wrong way! What is the meaning of this? We've got to leave Bruthia. The slaves have gone mad and are striking us all down. There is still enough of us, and they are only ignorant animals! And what about Tisa Zul? What will he do to us next? We don't know. But we have served you faithfully, Gakri. Now, we beg your permission to let us flee for our lives. Run from the manlings. Gakri! Never! No! No! but always ready for a little bit of fun, huh? <laughs> hey, where's Otley? The fool took the sword and went to fight the battle alone? Conan never came back. It's time to meet our doom. It's good that I go to the end with you. It should be this way. The minute my back is turned, they let the fire go out. Oddly! You're alive! <laughs> Conan, well met, my friend. Well met. Good to see you. Oh, God. Meet already. Any friend of Conan and Oddly's is a friend of Olcott. After I take you through the pass? Well, I thought you would have guessed. To see the cities of men. <laughs> <laughs> 